there are realities on the ground. For instance, the preferred price has changed. There might be a hike in power, power tariff. Yes. And all these two affect other prices around. Yes. Right? Transportation of food, goods and services mm. will be affected. So if cost of living is getting more expensive, but you're still left with a regular income, then you're going to have a corrupt politician. Yes. Mm. And some of us don't have that foundation. But you don't, we can't be corrupt politicians for anything. So it is only good to bring it to the floor, to debate on it, what they are giving us as allowance realistically can it foot the bills today in uh, living in abuja or living in this area with that kind of income mm. if the answer is no let's be realistic but i'd like to say first we should look at the common man and start with the uh, civil service if we can take care of our civil service first with the same increments because they are working every day, even when politicians are no more in office. I might, I'm here for four years. I pray I get re-elected. But if I'm not re-elected, that civil servant will just be maybe moving from assistant director to deputy director. He's living with that reality. He has children like I do. He's a human being like I. So but let's treat all our systems. From those in the, in the civil service, the organized and disorganized private sector. Mm. And then you can now come... To the point we are leaders we can wait to make sure everyone is okay first but then we're living realities for instance tomorrow is salah do you know how many calls i get by a second because i've just seen my that. constituents are going to <laughs> celebrate will, salah and i, I can't provide the cost <laughs> i'm only two weeks in office i've yeah. not they have not been allocated an office because the national assembly is on uh, on recess for renovation so we're only resuming on the 4th of July. Hopefully, some of the offices will be ready to be allocated. Many of us might not still have offices mm. at that point. Okay. So with all that, how do you expect me to have resources to support my moving voters? Okay. So it's, it's we get to your pressure. point. 